That was are, serious. That was serious, right? Uh huh. You are a trooper, pal. Oh. Thank you for doing this. Why did we do that? I have why no idea. Why did we do that? To I don't ourselves. understand why. It was so painful. You did chicken wings last time. I know. Hot wings this time. Are you good with? Are, Let's get some candy next time or something. I know. You know? Are you good with spicy though? Is I'm that... really good with spices. That was like 400 times. Isn't that what he said? Like 400 times. I mean, the seriously, or I have like everything is draining out of my head right now. It's like every orifice. Uh, seriously, every yeah, every orifice. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Brianka. Uh, last time we were on the show, we were talking about you Ooh. and uh, and Nick uh, be, being a celebrity couple. Do you have a celebrity name? Yeah, well, it didn't take. It didn't take. Well, no one wanted to, because Priyanka and Nick. Nobody wants to call us Prick. <laughs> it's just not taking off at all. It's just not. It's I've been not campaigning for it. I did no, it on no. your show. I know. I thought like maybe if I yelled it out on your show, I'd get a little bit more traction. <laughs> no. No. No, no one wants to do it. I think Nick doesn't like it. That's why he's not campaigning uh -huh. it for me. Uh, I'm a very supportive husband. Have you? Know? you uh, you're a very supportive uh, wife as well. You've been on tour with those uh, those guys. The Jonas yeah. Brothers, yeah. I couldn't even remember their name. Um, <laughs> I'm freaking out right now, those seriously. Guys, yeah, those three. Oh my gosh. Uh, oh. How's the tour been? It's been so great. They're doing like 75 shows in three months. It's crazy. They're in different city every day. They're crushing it though. But it's just so amazing. I didn't really know very much, and I'm gonna get killed for saying this, but before I got married and before I started dating Nick, I didn't know too much about the euphoria that is the Jonas Brothers. And when I started going to their concerts, just seeing like, 30,000 people singing every lyric was just like, I'm a full groupie now. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, they're crushing it. You're both crushing it. I mean, because you're out there promoting this, this movie. Uh, the sky is pink. My tongue is pink. I know, I exactly. Know. Uh, my tongue is red. Um, <laughs> explain to me this. This is, you're promoting the movie. Where, where are you here and how many people are involved? Yeah, this was New Delhi and this was Amity College in New Delhi. It was about 60,000 people that showed up. Wait, how does that work? I know. Where, where, like, where were you? Like, you this were was a... in a school, like literally a college. And you and said, like, hey, we just wanted to get the word we out? We wanted to come in and like speak to people and talk about the movie because it's like such a special movie and based on a real life family. And 60,000 people came in. It was, uh, it was incredible. I mean, the population so... of India helps. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> that's true. You're right. Uh, the movie is uh, beautiful. Uh, I will tell everyone to go see it. It's heartbreaking, uh, but it's also funny and it, it's a Family drama is the only best way I can set it up. It's real. It's a real family. Yeah, it's a true life story about a family that found out when their daughter was one that she had um, an illness where she would survive maybe five years. And they decided that even though she might not have a long life, they're going to give her a really, really big life and made everything an adventure. And, you know, she gobbled up life. She eventually went on to write a book, gave like a TED talk. Um, and lived like a really incredible life. So I feel like this movie is sort of so inspiring where in a world where we're so disjointed from our families, this reminds you how important family support can be and in a really positive, joyful way. Yeah, it, 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 it got a standing ovation in the Toronto Film Festival. Yeah. A 10 minutes standing ovation. Yeah, it did. That's got to feel it good, huh? It was amazing. I mean, for 10 minutes, people just kept clapping and people were crying and laughing and so many people came up to me after and said, you know, I felt like calling my mom or I, I felt like it just reminded me life is short and I want to live it so much. And I guess cinema should do that. And yeah, absolutely. I'm just so proud to be a part of something like that. Uh, it's, a, it's a great uh, film. Uh, do you want to set up this clip? Yeah, well, the clip that you're going to see is when 80% of marriages usually end up in divorce after, you know, you lose a child. And this is, um, this is the scene where she just loses it after she's lost her child and you know, starts sort of inflicting drama upon herself because she doesn't know what else to do. She's only taken care of her kid her whole life. Gosh. I want to show everyone a clip. Here's Priyanka Chopra Jonas in the sky is pink. Take a look. I won't be able to stay behind you, Niren. I was also here for London for you. Niren, you were not London for me. You were for Aisha for London. और अगर आए भी थे तो क्या बड़ी बात कर ली तुमने जता क्या रहे हो अपनी फैमिली के लिए आए थे इतना क्या महान हो गया अगर इतना भी नहीं कर सकते तो शादी नहीं करनी चाहिए थी किसी के लिए कुछ नहीं करना पड़ता तुमको हुआ क्या है तुमको कहां की बात कहां ले जा रही हो तुम मां बाहर हम बैठे डिनर ऑर्डर कर रहे हो तुम अरे तो जाओ ना यार खाना खाओ अपना ठंडा हो रहा तुम्हारा खाना वी आर गुड टू फॉर जोनस एवरीबॉडी ऑन एंड ऑन एंड ऑन Uh, yeah. And it's on and on and on